So I'm on my second day off. I'll get my shifts in today. It's a bit windier than yesterday. So vlogging might be a little bit more difficult. There's 13 miles yesterday. I'm not saying I'm gonna do 13 miles again, but I'd like to aim for a 10k at least. Which is 6.2 miles. So I've pretty much nearly got the field to myself now because there's two, there's two people with two dogs walking that way two of the ugliest dogs I've ever seen no offense, I like dogs but man, they're fucking ugly man so, <laughs> then there's somebody that's just walking around I thought it would go in then but it's just walking around so I haven't got the field to myself have I so we're just walking around so wow they need to go out, they need to go out man so, I'm not actually going to aim to do 13 miles of walking, but I'll aim to try get close. Because I can go out now, and then, for about an hour, then my dad goes to the thing before he goes out. Uh, then, <laughs> I think, yeah, I think I'll go out for an hour, and then my dad will probably want to go out for half an hour before he goes to work. Then, same thing, like I'll probably just, it'll get to like two-ish and I'll get to walk them from like two till four or two till five or maybe, two till four or three till five. I think two till four sounds a better, man. better idea. Get dark already. It was nice yesterday. It's going to be forecast rain from one o'clock on till Friday five o'clock in the morning. Damn. That's bad. Yes. I've got the field to myself. <sighs> that other person just walked off the field. Hey. Oh, bastard. And now someone else is behind me. Someone behind me now. Never mind. Oh, God. I feel like it's in a, a red alert thing, like... Whenever I've got the field to myself, people are like, let's go on it. <laughs> Awkward silence. Silent Jamie. Jesus, what was that? Anyway, um, yeah. <laughs> See you soon. Huh. So this is really close to where I live. Like literally just down there and quite not far off but it's a street name named after Ayaborn Phoenix and Terrorizer but Ayaborn Phoenix because it's a B-R-Y-A-N and Terrorizer is B-R-I-A-N so it's Ayaborn Phoenix that very good YouTuber that I like to watch on YouTube so I've come to Shaw Park Wind's picked up again, and I'm praying nobody wants to interrupt me because I'm trying to vlog and people just get a kick out of it. Like, like, uh, like, uh, like how about you go home and uh, stay there whilst I'm trying to video? Like, seriously, like, I'm trying to video and video and make content, and you're just and people who are interrupting me just want to be a dick. Go home, stay there. Good. Stay there. Uh, so I tried to vlog. I tried to vlog like along the way, and it was just so difficult. Like people, just so many people getting in the way and things to watch out for, and you know, it's like get lost, get lost. So I've come to Shaw Park because the dogs need a run anyway. Tries to come out of there. Cause, well, I was trying to explain. So we set off and it was raining a little bit and then I think we've just had like a week's worth of rain in 10 minutes. I'm not even kidding, it was just absolutely poured it down. I was like, what? I was like, what? There was so much rain, it stopped now. But like, what the hell? It just it literally came so fast. <sighs> You're under right shaking. 
I'm walking down a hill where there's steps so my cat my, my phone is gonna be a bit shaky yeah so I'm coming up this way for a change that wall man at the back damn so left shore park I'm gonna head up to Jagger Green Lane or Old Lindley so my legs are gonna get a right workout I'm glad I brought my inhaler man because I'm gonna need it when I get to the top Whew. so I'm gonna stop filming now because this path is quite narrow so I need to really pay attention to where I'm walking especially as bits have grown over the path and I am six foot four and a half look at that bit damn it's completely covered freaking hell I had to well duck to get under that god I'm out of breath that's the top and that is where I've just walked for uh, let's carry on so it's raining yet again made it to the top that doesn't look much it really doesn't sorry my camera's focused come on focus it doesn't look much but it really is it's a, it's a right leg burner so I'm going to walk this way and I think I'm going to turn left and get my bloody breath back Whew. right I'm just going to stop because I'm going to sh my camera's going to sh start again my phone is going to shake like mad walking down here god what a nice view if I carried on my phone would be just doing this and I don't really want that well, I'm just doing that as a joke, but if I carried on walking down the hill, that's what's going to happen. Oh. So, this morning, I'm going for a little walk with the dogs. 7.40. Get back for about half eight. Or like 35 past or 40 past. Then, dry them. Quickly get changed. Then uh, have a little sit down for like five to minutes, then go. I've got five ten. No, start No, 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 no. Ten till five today. Um, and then tomorrow on Sunday, I have from seven o'clock in the morning till two in the afternoon. That's both Saturday and Sunday. Then next week's shifts are as follows. So. I'll tell, I'll tell you at a better time. So, last year, uh, unfortunately, my mum got into a bit of a situation with having a crash. Not her fault though, because somebody on my street who went to my school, Anthony Wadsworth or something like that, but I've got the first name right, he was just driving up the street like a twat. So I just completely, like, oh, they were saying like, oh, I'm going 20 miles an hour. It was going about 50. Uh, so, and I was like, like, that's random, yeah, but why? But so, basically, whenever I take my dogs out, there's a dog that goes, woo, woo, woo. It's okay, Holly, it's all right. I'm just impersonating that dickhead of a dog. Uh, so, whenever it's out, I was like, where does it live? And it lives where this guy, Anthony Wadsworth, just drove like a twat into my mum's car. So, I was like, oh, oh, okay, right, yeah. So, like, ooh, this is uh, interesting. I can take the piss out of their dog as a revenge. Well, oh, because the thing is, it just barks it out. I think I saw it bark at a fly once, I'm not even joking. 
or a little speck of dust. I'm not sure. It's windy, it's cold. But when I'm in McDonald's this morning, through till this afternoon, I'll get nice and warm. Because usually being upstairs is quite nice and warm. It's lovely. It's nicer than this. I'm going to stop filming because now I've had my hand in the same spot for two minutes and it's becoming a little bit frozen. So, uh, see you later. So, I'm on my way to the bus stop to get a bus. Um, so, the shifts are. Uh, so I'm doing Thursday, Friday, Saturday, doing Friday, Saturday, Sunday today this week. Then I've got Monday off. Then I'm doing Tuesday, Wednesday, ten five. Both of them. Then the Thursday, seven till two. Then the Friday and Saturday, I'm doing five till eleven. Just watching the road because it's. At that point where people don't give a shit what they do, I it's five past nine. It's just gone past nine o'clock. So yeah, I've got two ten five shifts, then one seven two, and then two five eleven shifts. Yep. So I'm walking a different way to McDonald's for a change. Uh, walking a bit of an extended route. I don't saddle ten. And the thing is, it's only 25 past 9, so I can actually walk around Halifax for 20 minutes if I do so desired to. But bloody hell, it's cold. Oh my god. Jeez. So this is slightly different, and you're thinking, why am I out at this time? It's 6 o'clock in the morning, it's just gone past 6 o'clock in the morning. And you might be thinking, Jamie, why are you out at this time? Well, uh, I'm going to work. I'm doing a 7 o'clock start until 2 o'clock, and I'm doing the same tomorrow. So uh, it's quiet, it's really quiet. I mean, I'm only just up my street, so I can't really judge it. But, Saturday morning, I should imagine it'd be dead quiet. Because, the thing is, on a Friday night, a lot of people get drunk. And a lot of people want to sleep in on a Saturday. Uh, not me. I just couldn't get to sleep. I was just so wide awake. I was like, okay. <laughs> So I'm gonna do the seven shift, seven two shift. Uh, so I'm gonna get there. I need to do a trash walk around the premises, uh, which is going around McDonald's for like five minutes, ten minutes. Then go back and then I've registered it that I've done it. Then I need to collect the newspapers from the news agents. I've been shown which one to go to. Then basically start inside and just make sure everything's fine for 8 o'clock opening I mean okay when I'm gonna be there it's gonna be open anyway but the bit upstairs for people to go upstairs and have whatever they want uh, is open at 8 o'clock on a morning and plus as well because I'm going to have a habit of break at 10 o'clock uh, Breakfast service doesn't stop. Go, breakfast service stops at half ten, so I can get a bacon and egg McMuffin. Yeah, I've gone because it's dark. <laughs> so uh, see you later. So that see you later bit was like literally five minutes later. <laughs> it's so quiet. It's weird, like, like, it's still quite dark and there's a plane in the sky that I can see. Hold on. It's a plane. I should be getting a shift on, I don't want to miss this bus. This is so weird, man. It really is. Like, I'm just able to walk, like, 
willy nilly. Like, it's just not even difficult to get. It took barely any time to get to the bus stop. Eight minutes. It's up there. You, you can you can see the time. You can see up there. So if it's eight minutes away, oh hello. Seven minutes away. Oh hello. So it's six seventeen, and not something you see every day. This road being totally quiet. It's six seventeen, so three minutes until the the bus comes. It won't focus because the lighting's all over the place. So, I'm in Halifax, just approaching McDonald's. I don't need to much drive everyone. Not when it's like literally less than 0.1 miles from the bus stop to McDonald's anyway. So, uh, yeah. There it is, just in the distance, just there. There is McDonald's. God, I'm out of breath. So I'm walking to a bus stop. I'm actually just, I need to stretch my legs because I've just been so busy. Thank God. If 17 is like that tomorrow, it was just stupid. It was just fucking stupid. Like, like busy. But do you know when people are just stood inside and they're not even ordering, they're just chatting? Get the fuck out. <laughs> like, if you're not paying for it, you're not ordering for it, the door's there, go outside. Because I, I felt very claustrophobic. I was like, I just felt scared a little bit. Like, I felt like very un, un, uneasy and I didn't, I, I did, it was good, but. I just felt, I, I that got very close. I just felt very, like, out of place. I just felt very squished. I hate being squished. So I'm doing 7-2 tomorrow. So it's just a matter of what that'll bring. So I'm gonna break at 10 o'clock. So I think when I get home, I'll just stay home. And if I feel fine, after like half an hour, an hour or so, I might go out. But I generally don't know. I was thinking, oh great, I might actually go back out straight away, but I can't, I just don't have the energy. I really don't. Bloody hell. So, I am going to work, and I can feel the snow on my, in my, on, as I'm walking, because it has snowed a little bit, but it's not really stuck, it's just more like, well it has stuck a tent a little bit, but it's not actually like properly snowy, which is a good thing. Uh, it's a little bit cold, yeah, but it's not too bad. The bus is at half six, so I'd have like, like 15 minutes for it to get to Halifax and then pretty much just walk straight to McDonald's and get the bus. No, 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 just get straight, the bus just go straight there. Uh, <sighs> a little bit tired, I actually walk, instead of like waking up in sections, like yesterday, and at like certain intervals, I just walked straight up at 5:25. My alarm proper woke me up. It was like it just like Ugh. so. As I feel, I'll feel more awake later on. Like I still feel a little sleepy, but yeah. I think it's Saturday morning. There was a few people in, but Sunday morning. This time? I'm not sure. Like, I don't know. You can't predict what you can't 
you can't predict what you don't know, which is a, which is true. And I was trying to advertise my shift for next Friday because unfortunate. Well, it's not unfortunate, but my cousin's moving to Australia, and like like actually going for good, like and is doing a leaving meal next Friday. And I'd love to go, but my shift at the moment is a 5.11 and it's at half six. So it looks like I wouldn't be able to go, but I really want to go. So I've advertised it and talked to staff about it. Uh, so they're gonna get, I think they're gonna get it sorted somehow. I said I would swap a shift. I would swap a shift with somebody. cold man but it's actually not too bad it's nice and quiet as well isn't it usually like this time when people are like oh fancy just doing a crime anyway anyway i'm gonna put my phone away stop vlogging for a bit and uh yeah i'm just gonna before i actually do finish i'm just gonna walk past here I worked here. There's still time. Carol Cleaning Company. I used to work for them. No, I'm actually going to put the phone away because it started snowing again. And I don't want to get my phone wet. I am so used to seeing this road quiet. Uh, not quiet, busy. Like always. So it's weird to be out now and it'd be like this. I mean, I'm just standing in the road. There's nobody. Th apart from the car that went up there. Because I was just about to film this bit. I was like, oh, it's nice and quiet. And then a car pulls out a co-op. I was like, yep, that's very uh, like me, isn't it? I say something and then something else happens. I'm going to get out the road because it is still a road. So the next bus is at 6.30, as I probably just said. And I'm not waiting at that stop there for 20 minutes. Because uh, in that 20 minutes, I could probably walk to Salter Hebel by that point. Like, I know I'm taking a risk by actually going, but the first bus, like the actual first bus is 6.30. So, uh, if I, I get to at least the bus stop for like 25 past, then stop, then I know I'm safe. Well, that's the theory anyway. That's the theory. So I have to be careful with vlogging because I've only got like 14 minutes left. But yesterday I got over 100k. Uh, and it's today the 11th. So I have until the 28th because it's February because of the leap year thing. So I have got till the 28th of February to get to 200k. I think I should be able to do it. Right, time to go to work. So, I'm doing something dead stupid. I'm vlogging during a heavy, sh heavy uh, during a heavy snow shower. And I'm not kidding. It's heavy. Alright. So, I'm not going to be able to vlog for too long. And also, well, don't get the phone wet. Which is kind of ironic because I'm doing it right now because I'm already getting it wet. So yeah, I'm going to put the phone away and carry on walking. Oh, yeah, and by the way, I'm, I'm like, you're mad walking. I'm like, yeah, yeah. I was going to get in the bus. I thought, I've not. I feel fine from. I feel totally fine. I'll just walk. How? What? What could go wrong? What could go wrong? Every snow shower. So, <laughs> so what? But the thing is, it's not rain. If it's rain, it gets to you. If it's snow, it's different because it's softer. Because the snow is softer than the rain, so it's not as bad. Actually, it's not heavy as much. It's not as heavy now. But by God, ten minutes ago, it was. My God, it was. I was like, that's how bad it was. I was like, oh God. Anyway. See you Remember how it was absolutely blasting it down with snow? Stop now. It's gone. It's absolutely gone. 
So I'm a bit out of breath. I just walked to Halifax and it's I'm nearly home. And I reckon I'll have done just under four miles by the time I get home. I've worked I've got I walked home in my uniform. It just shows I can do it. Like like if I really had to walk into work, I could do. And if I really had to walk home from work, then I can. Oh, bloody hell. I'm going up. So put my feet up, have a rest, and chill. So, welcome to the next morning. Uh, so, I haven't really got much left to footage wise. So, we're going to walk the dogs twice, then have everything put together. Then I'm going out separately at like half, half one to meet Ryan and then I'll start a new video off. What the actual fuck do people think when they... Right, I'm just going to showcase this jackass here. That's a parking right on the pavement, getting in the way and we have another jackass. In fact, we have a few. Right on the pavement. And then this jackass. Right on the pavement. So I have to walk on the road. Thankfully, it's not a busy road, but. And if you've looked at the background by now, it snowed. <laughs> it snowed. So, yeah, it's it snowed. So, I mean, yesterday it was it snowed so much, like like it was a, a heavy shower and it just didn't stick. And then in the evening it snowed, and I was like, looked outside, I was like, whoa, what the fuck, what the hell? And yeah, it's all stuck. So uh, there's no ice, thank God. It's just snow, which is good. Because yesterday was just horrible in the evening. It was so damn cold and it was so icy. I was like, I don't even want to be outside. It was true. I wouldn't be surprised if you can hear me right now because it's quite windy. But, oh, do you know, honestly, like, I'm walking along Victoria Road and, like, so busy with people going to school. Get to the field. There's no one except just now I've just spotted a woman walking her dog very slowly at the other end of the field. Because there's a thing about people bringing the dogs and then just letting the dogs do the running. And then the people are just like, eh, eh, doing out. They're like, you've got dogs. Walk them. Also, my head as well. The field is completely covered in the snow, so it's completely it's nice. It's not, it's not muddy. It's not wet, but if it warms up and the ice melts, ice and the snow melts even, then yes, it will go into the ground and become wet. Nice, nice to do a little bit of vlogging before I go out again. Because I'd love to do a 10k. Actually, scratch that. I'm doing a 10.5 tomorrow and Wednesday. So I would love to do more than a 10k today, at least. I could do at least a 10k before I've even gone out. That'd be good. You can hear them, can't you? <laughs> so if I could do at least a 10k before I've gone out to meet Ryan, then. Yeah. Oh, it's turning sunny now. Ah. <laughs> it's nice. It's nice now. Ah, just well snowed for about five minutes. <laughs> it's just like well snowed for like five minutes. It's like, oh no. I just walk on field. It's lovely. Lovely. 
when I came on the field yesterday, I came on with my dad, I was like, the, you, you, the majority of it was just grass with a tiny little bit of snow. And then, oh, hello. Oh, you a good boy. Oh, you eating it? Oh. Hello. This is night. Is this snow? At least, actually, with it being snowy, they're not going to be muddy. In theory, anyway. Look at it. It's so nice. Sun there. Shouldn't really be looking at that. And then in the distance, like behind there, on the hills, it's all snowy. Ah. <sighs> Showing. Why? Oh, because they're from Brooksburg. It's cool. That probably be why. Right, I'm going to carry on walking now, so uh, I'm going to stop filming. That's turned dark quite quick. Really nice over there. Look how dark it is there. That to me looks like there's going to be another a wave of another wave of snow. E. down there because there's a lot of arguing. What on earth is going on? I don't know what they're saying, but there's a lot of arguing. 